Hey, what's going on guys? I just wanted to make a video real quick because I was having some trouble in GarageBand um, with my project. Uh, what happened was I must have created a track um, and I ended up soloing it by hitting those headphones if you didn't know. Um, and I didn't want it, so while it was soloed, I deleted it. After I did that, um, I had to run somewhere real quick, so I just quit GarageBand and saved the project. And when I opened it back up, um, whenever I would hit play, this isn't going to work, but let's just solo this. So whenever I would hit play, um, none of this audio would come up at all. A bunch. Obviously, it's coming up now. But yeah. None of it would play. I checked all my tracks. I checked the mute buttons, the solo buttons, all that stuff. Messed with uh, my preferences, my um, you know input output settings. I pretty much did everything you could think of. So after going through a bunch of forums and stuff, I found out what the problem was. And don't think you have to you know copy and paste and edit in a bunch of new projects and stuff. Um, all I really had to do was go to track and then don't create a new track, create new basic track. And then when this new basic track came up, it was already soloed. And all I did was unsolo it and then all of this audio would play again. And then I just deleted the track. If that makes sense. Um Yeah, that's really all you have to do. I'm just trying to think. Um, there shouldn't be any other problems. Another guy on a forum said he had to create multiple tracks before he saw the one that was soloed, and then he just unsoloed it. Um, if this still isn't working for you, uh, I mean, just check all your settings, um, and if worse comes to worse, you may have to copy and paste. But this worked for me, just creating a new basic track and unsoloing it. Um, I really hope this tutorial helped, and I hope you guys can continue making your music now. Alright, thanks a lot. Bye.